Okay then, our stock is bubbling, lovely. I put inside maybe four bay leaves and maybe five peppercorns just to start it off. Now our vegetables are peeled. So what we've got here is a large parsnip. Nice chunk of celery and three carrots, and I scraped them out already. Right. That kind of piece of leek will be enough. So I just cut it in two and rub it in. Carrots, I like carrots. Uh, to be chopped just in circles. So carrots, you don't chop them into very small pieces. They're quite chunky and put it into the stock. Now your parsnip. I will do them once in strips. This is a quiet large piece. They will give that stock absolutely amazing flavor. Okay, so that's in. Now that one and your celery. Now once all of your vegetables are in a pot and bubbling with pieces of meat and bay leaves, we add one chicken stock cube and let it cook. Okay then, so your soup start looking nice, the color is changing, I don't know if you can see it, yeah, there you go. Stop. Stop coming nicely together. The carrots are not far away from being soft. Now you can try it for the taste and if necessary put some more salt. We need just literally sprinkle. I don't even know if that's a half of teaspoon. On the side, prepare yourself water for your pasta, noodles, whatever you want. And at that stage, I'll put really nice big handful of parsley. Parsley will lovely complement the whole flavor of your stock and your chicken noodle soup will be absolutely amazing. Now, one more thing. There's something what my mom was doing back in the day, but we don't have a fire, we don't have a gas stove. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to grill it. She used to put quarters of the onion on the fire, just to roast them a little bit. Then she put it in the soup. And that flavor, I remember from my childhood, was absolutely incredible. I'm going to stick it to the grill just to see how it will turn up and I will see you in a bit. Now, your chicken soup is pretty much ready. That color and smell is just wonderful. Carrots are soft. Your noodles nearly there. We will drain them in a second. You can pick any noodles, pasta, whatever you want to complement that soup as the 
getting there they are getting slowly grilled but the smell is amazing Traditional chicken noodle soup. Enjoy, guys! If you like that recipe, which is full of flavor and so easy to make, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Share your comments with me if you tried it. I want to know how did that come up, and don't forget that we are here trying to present you with the easy recipes and enjoy the whole family. 